Welcome back to another video. Video. Not okay. Stay woke. Uh. When the horse stood up. Ancient spiritual technology. Demon. <laughs> Your name is Paul Paul. Okay. Okay. Peace. What if I told you this TV show is using black magic and we all are under a spell right now? Would you believe it? The writers of this TV show don't predict nothing. They can't see into the future, but we can. So they use us to make it manifest. If you understand what was happening in 2023, you will be able to see what's going to happen in 2024. It's all about magic. In 2023, they had a new king of England. Mexico released all kinds of aliens. We had people that's vanishing out of nowhere. They said September 23 will be the end of the world. October 4th, they sent a national alert out to everyone's phone in America. People are now eating lab-grown meat. They still eat it, and they know it's still lab-grown. People in Peru had aliens attack them. Woke people are waiting for the Anunnaki to come back and save them. We had a blue supermoon that we might not ever see again. After the blue supermoon, we had a harvest moon. We about to have a solar eclipse. All these events I just named in 2023, this cartoon predicted. No, they didn't predict. They made us predict it. When people say I'm woke and they say you're asleep, all they really saying is you are under a deep spell. Every time you spell your name, you are under a spell. Every time you write your name in cursive, you are putting a curse on yourself. Everything in this language is dealing with curses and spells to trap your energy. If you want to know what's going to happen next, it's the same shit that happened before. They even said it was demonic to use magic spells. Wait, so they can use magic spells on us and it's okay. But if we use it, it's demonic. Please make it make sense. In order to protect your energy, to stop making things manifest, you can't let them get the best of you. But when something takes place in the world and you speak about it, you are actually changing different realities. We create with our mind. We have energy fields, aura fields, chakras, or even a merkaba that surround our bodies to actually protect us. But if you have a weak aura field, nothing can protect you. If you have no protection, they can put seeds in your mind and create their TV show realities. They're not predicting nothing. We do it every time we watch it. And they use our avatars or our physical bodies like they are avatars. Every time they put something out there in the world, they are literally poking us and we create it.